Hello, everybody. Welcome to a reaction stream from MinMax for PlayStation State of Play. You know the one, the one that happened on January 31st, 2024. Uh, MinMax is a place about games, friends, getting better. My name is Ben Hansen. Thank you for being here. I'm joined by community manager Haley McLean. Hello. Also the host of Bonus Pod for Patreon supporters. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I saw, I think, the most flattering YouTube comment, Haley. I see a lot of nice comments about that show and stuff, but we made a clip that we put on YouTube recently, and someone said, mm -hmm. this isn't fair. This content's too good. Like, it's not fair that we don't get to see it. Like, well, that's kind of the goal. We want people to go to Patreon for, like, at least one show. Make one exclusive, <laughs> That is the please. point, but thank you for wanting <laughs> it to be free. <laughs> we dare you to ignore it. Uh, also joined by Jeff Sipmaster Marquiafava. That's me. What a, what a nickname. Wow. And it's that level of energy you'll see from him throughout this entire state of play. Also joined by Jacob Geller. Number one stellar Blade fan, everyone. He's going to prove it. Like, when you when you guys, like, after this PlayStation state of play, when you all watch your, like, compilation videos on YouTube of stellar Blade reaction videos, they're just going to have a blown-up version of Jacob's reaction. It's going to be, like, yeah. 100 pixels by 100 pixels. Ah, ah, it's too stellar, too stellar. Um, this You're is... like, do you want to just get my thumbnail right now? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> That's, and now you seem to recreate Perfect. that perfectly so people don't accuse us of clickbait when Stellar Blade pops up. Okay. Um, this is it, everybody. I mean, we don't really know what to expect. There have been a couple leaks, murmurs, rumors um, that we won't spoil here just in case you haven't seen them, but roughly 40 minutes, Sony said they're showing Stellar Blade. They're going to begin, middle, and end with Stellar Blade. Uh, they said they're going to be showing Rise of Ronin, which looks great. Um, but then it didn't even say, like, first party or third party. Like, there might be a mix um, going on here. Maybe second party. Winky winky. We'll see. But before we jump in, thank you for being here. You can always uh, help support independent games media by subscribing to MinMax's YouTube channel for more of this type of stuff. Or might I guide your eye this way, keen-eyed viewer, if you subscribe to the MinMax Show podcast on Apple Podcasts, the MinMax Show. It's our free podcast we put out every week. We're recording an episode right after this where we're going to be unpacking this in a more thorough way. You subscribe to the MinMax Show podcast on Apple Podcasts and you leave a review and include some way to contact you, like Twitter handle or Discord ID. You are in the running to win a code for Tekken 8. This Monday, we're going to randomly choose one person to win a code for Tekken 8 on PS5. So if you want to play the hot new game, Tekken 8, on your PS5, all you have to do is subscribe to the MinMax Show podcast and then leave a review with some way to reach out to you. And then you can play as all your favorites from Tekken 8. But uh, we'd prefer if you only played the Panda. Uh, we appreciate that in a big way. Yeah, so. I was going to say, that's Panda propaganda, that clip you chose, Ben. <laughs> I know, it really was. Well, it's like, what Tekken clip do we show? I, you got to go pure Panda propaganda. But thanks, everybody, for subscribing to our YouTube channel or where you can win a prize by subscribing to the MinMax Show on Apple Podcasts. And all you Spotify listeners, I love you and encourage you. I don't love you. That's a little gross. I encourage you to listen wherever you want to listen. But you can't leave, like, a text review on Spotify. So that's why it's, like, an Apple exclusive there. Because that's where you can actually leave oh. a little blurb and say what you think about our podcast and all that stuff. But uh, let's see. Jacob, what are you looking forward to here? What do you want to see in this whole thing? I, I think I've been very clear. But other <laughs> other than Stellar Blade, um, I don't know. I want to see... Um, I'd like to see some kind of, like, interesting horror title, maybe. Okay. Does Death Stranding 2 count as horror? I, yeah, well, look, I'm I'm so far in Kojima's camp after the last season of Something Rotten, which is covering Metal Gear Solid 1 and 2, so I'm... I, lay it on me. Get him on stage at the Game Awards and let him just talk for 15 minutes again. That should just be the award, is him on stage, Kojima, just for three hours, and then every once in a while, Keeley just whips out another award from behind his back and hands it to him. Like, that's the ideal award show experience, I understand. Uh, Haley, looking forward to anything? Death Stranding 2, probably, okay. if they show anything there. And I remember being kind of intrigued by Rise of the Ronin, actually. That last yeah. trailer they showed where it was like 12 million different games at once. Right. I don't know if I'd play it, but I was impressed by <laughs> what that game's trying to do. Impressed. I'm most curious to see how they message PSVR 2 stuff. If we're going to have the like, yeah. ah, they're like the second wave finally coming. Because the first wave we're still trying to recover from. It didn't even say PSVR 2 in that little blurb that just happened. Yeah, but trust me, it's going to be a wave, dude. A wave like you've never oh, felt okay. before, Jacob. You like Helldivers, don't you, Ben? I did like that first one, yeah. Um, yeah? I'm looking forward to this. Uh, maybe we'll be talking about it in an upcoming episode of the MinMax Show podcast. But uh, yeah, I'm curious to see the shift to the third person, how it holds up. Because the first one was like isometric. But the cool thing with the first Helldivers 
was the idea of like you can revive your teammates and do like special commands but you have to put in like very specific it basically like cheat codes like up up down down left huh. right left right like it's really elaborate stuff you had to type in really fast in order to do these elaborate things while action was going on it was, it's a very specific thing but like it made it memorable to me for all these years you know do you always play co-op with uh, it honestly do you want to hear something embarrassing my main time oh. playing this was like at a preview event where we played like with the developers um and it oh, was like a really fun, fun session jeff were you there for that by chance no i wasn't but i uh reviewed it ah back at game but, but uh, yes when we did it i specifically said i don't want hansen you know messing Man, coming in here and I'm playing Roman with Hills, us because it's gonna mess up my studios and I'm I get to it. Present man. the first state of play of 2024. Let's get these in English. The first three years of PS5 have given us incredible stories. Oh, Airbag's good. Immersive worlds right, and I'm just groundbreaking gameplay oh. from PlayStation Studios and their partners. We've also. Chance of Sonara has me thinking I can actually read anything now when I see the new language is coming up. And with PSVR 2, it just needs to have like an elevator next to it. Last November, and you're like, oh yeah, come up. to offering new and surprising ways for audience to interact with their PS5. But none of this means anything without great games, like Helldivers 2, which kicks off a year of amazing experiences and diverse ways to play. Today, we're looking ahead to titles coming later this year and beyond, with extended gameplay and announcements we hope you find as exciting as we do here at PlayStation. Enjoy the show. Is this the first one of Herman Hulse, like presenting like that? Probably, because I, I was like, who's that ever? guy? Yeah. Oh. yeah, same here, Jacob. I was like, God, I think so. All right, here we go. Fun. Jacob Geller's number one game. All right off the bat for you, Jacob. Hang on. I'm studying his face. I'm not seeing it quite yet. Gotta wait for the moment to pop it. I understand. <laughs> okay. Shift up. Ooh, light up earrings. Why have I never thought of that? That's so cool. In I your personal light life? Earrings. Yeah. Welcome to the world of Stellar Blade. Ooh, one of these. The story begins on post-apocalyptic Earth. Let us know the volume is, everybody. Where a mysterious enemy called the Nativa has forced the human race to flee to an off-world colony. I don't know if this is the best format for this Players game. Will take yeah. It's like, I don't care about the lore. The you squad. will, buddy, you will. Her mission is to save the planet by defeating the Elder Now this is the good stuff. That there health bar go. is looking good. Yeah, that's it. That's what I want. You must do is complete the mission. Those hair While physics, that's what I want. Why did her hair look thin, though? Oh, that was thin we hair. We don't it's hair the shame here, right. Haley. They got. Adam, born on Earth, like is in pursuit of no, an Adam, thick head of hair. Make sure to stay cautious. Each stock like thick it's spaghetti. It's off on AT bias. So this must be 807. Lily, a member of the fifth airborne squad, provides engineering support. Lily Artemis II. Then I can be your engineering support. She Racer? puts her technique puts her technical knowledge to use by upgrading Eve's equipment throughout the game. All right. Yeah. Done. Something does feel different. Yeah, hey, you have a giant thing on your arm. Hey, double jump. Automatically a good game. There you go. There My knees feel better. <laughs> I think I can this defy physics now. <laughs> a city built underneath the wasteland by the last human survivors on Earth. <laughs> Gotta say, this is really not showing me Eve is called the Eve thing that I assumed this game was, which is the game where you stylishly fear. kick people. <laughs> They'll get to that. They'll get to that. Don't you want to see this guy's face for a while first? <laughs> I played... Uh, why can't I think of the name? What was that in-game? Rage? Yep. yep. <laughs> These just look like leftover Rage yeah. character designs. The survivors will sometimes ask you for help. Is it Fritos in the Please sister. Wait for Find the cat. cat. Mission confirmed. Yes. Yes. Good gaming confirmed. Their requests will often lead her to the wasteland and the great desert. The side quest will bring you to the desert well, frequently. Oh, boy. <laughs> <laughs> this place has been overrun by Nativas. And malfunctioning machines and robots. A supply camp in a place like this. You will occasionally find supply stations set up by previous airborne squads. How much personality is that robot going to have, I wonder? At each camp, Eve can purchase various consumable items. Son? I feel like this is just defining steps. what a video game is. <laughs> hey, come on. I saw your you face in the items, beginning. You can't go you can back on it now. Equipment and more. Well, you need X. to have a shocked oh, YouTube face every time you see crafting in the game, no matter what. I'm sorry. Help. 
Eve will often encounter people in need. Little stray cameo. And other non-human beings who may need her help. What the hell? Your assistance. Whether to like assist or Sentient into airbag? Is entirely up to the player. <laughs> Why did we make these sentient? <laughs> Eve will sometimes encounter okay, I'm liking how many different outfits she has. Okay. That's what or. I'm paying attention to. Oh, a hand face cat. Something worse. Her hair's so oh my God. thin. If I went to my hairdresser with that hair, she'd tell me to chop it and start fresh. <laughs> and that's happened to me before. She has to sit on the back of the subway because her hair is too long. Right? They can think that the point of your existence is to snuff out another species. The fighting looks really cool, though. Okay, yeah, so this is what I want to see. This elevator, you mean? The elevator's what you want to see? Oh, yeah, thank God. It almost showed the fighting. I wasn't interested in that. the Eve Airborne Squad. I can feel the hatred, but I cannot feel the source. I will find it, and I will make it pay. Open it. They're giving this a Spend lot of time it. in the spotlight. Yeah. yeah. There we go. This is thick hair. All right, personality's building. It's building. It's different. This is no longer the drone you knew. Drops a bomb to her back. This feels different. I like it. <laughs> Whoa. That sounds cool. I like that very I feel like all of the designs here are like A plus. Yeah. You yeah. know, like whenever they show a new character, I'm like, well that outfit's impractical. But I'm also like, looks cool. <laughs> there you go, Jacob. Alright. This is what I want. Okay, oh. right up the spine. Uh, tough one to it's read. It's giving YouTube intro. <laughs> Is it not? April 26th. YouTube intro? Yeah, you know, it's like, welcome to Gamer669's channel. And they cut to like... <laughs> what I want to know is like, how much wanted dead energy is that game going to have? Right, right. Seems like a lot. Also, is it going to be like five hours long? Or like 30? That didn't look like a five hour long game, just based on how many different... Things there were. The music sting for him leaving. <laughs> this one's for you, Sarah. Oh, it's 2D. Never mind. This one, I take back. Hey, well, there's. Sound. It's both. Oh, hey. Yeah, this one's for you again, Sarah. It's half for you, Sarah. <laughs> is this just this is Sonic oh, Generations? Sonic. Ooh. Uh oh. <laughs> there he is. The one we actually care about. Voiced by Hayden Christensen, no doubt. Wow, he's playing stellar blade level. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, that, that level was cool. That was cool. This is too adult! Sonic Cross Shadow, Shadow Generations? Is that the way that's spelled? All right. I, I don't know why my gut said and, but I think you're right. That showed a bear scratching his butt and then a guy sniffing his finger and my brain combined the two. I was like, that's gross. <laughs> you just really missed one of the bears, right? I realized they were different people. <laughs> I like the uh, that animation, like that super stretchy jump. Hang on, yeah. am I into Hoyo Ooh. stuff?
I like that weapon. I like all these ingredients, I think. You like that cat girl? I like cat girls. I've never met one in real life, but... That animation looks fun. Oh, yeah. Oh, wait, it's the mobile nope. game. It's easy. Sorry. Unless it's coming to PS5. Oh! I couldn't imagine that's the case. All right. Okay, now we're starting. Ah, uh, where's Leo? Wow, bitrate be absolutely crushed by this. <laughs> <laughs> it's too much. Oh boy, invisible showdowns. All right, he's fun. <laughs> that's fun. We're all kind of dancing like high fi Rush, just like always bopping. I like that. Yeah. Wasn't there some recent AI controversy with Bone Stars? Like, there's like oh, albums God, in there? the game, and I guess AI made the albums in the game. Mm. Which is like, oh, this seems like that'd be the fun thing as an artist, just to make like weird album covers, but that's soon. AI is going to take the fun things, I think, is the worry. <laughs> Ooh! Oh boy. Wow, another chance for it to be game of the year. There we go. <laughs> Fun custom animations. Weird for it to say captured on PC prominently. Oh, did it really? No. Yeah, yeah, it's nice they're being honest. All right. If you put a gun to my head, I would have guessed it's already there, but sure, that's exciting. I thought it was too. <laughs> Oh my gosh, Godzilla? Is it? And that's the Godzilla theme. Uh, yeah. It's what Godzilla, the hell? shut up. That is ridiculous. Godzilla's everywhere. <laughs> First dredge, now Godzilla? What IP can't they get? That is weird. Dave the Diver is becoming the multiverse, isn't it? It's, <laughs> this is Ready Player Fortnite. One. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. What do you do with Godzilla? <laughs> <laughs> he just watches you cook? I don't know. Ooh. V Rising? Mm. The game we all agree is was good in 2022, but we didn't play. That's what it is, right, chat? A lot of people are screaming for a Legacy of Kane game. Look, that'd be awesome. But it, okay, yeah, this would be rising, all right. I've always been meaning to boot this one up. Jeffem, are you playing Enshrouded? No, not yet. Okay. I'm on Enshrouded TikTok, but I'm not playing it. It looks fun. What yeah, I've just seen a bunch of articles. I, I got sucked into an algorithm, I think. And it's all like, look at all these things that people are building in Enshrouded. And it looks cool. Once people start building and terraforming in a game, mm -hmm. uh, that's it. Might I interest I'm, you in a game I'm called Pal World, Jeff? I played Hi, Pal everyone. Oh, okay. I'm Sean Benson. This next game is a result of a very close <laughs> partnership with Konami. It marks the return of a horror franchise that has Hello. been with us since the original PlayStation. Hello. Let's take a look Ooh, at they heard you, Jacob. Silent Hill. I wasn't even thinking of this. We can turn the stream off then if you weren't thinking of it. <laughs> oh, but is it not? Oh, is it it's the... It's not two. Maybe Interesting. Like it's that her. other one? Silent F or whatever? Yeah, is it the one that looked good? Because it's not Ascension. Jeff, I'm destroy your life, dude. Here it goes. It's right. <laughs> and it's that type of fun back and forth. Is this a dream? Interesting. Who's there? Oh, that's so scary. What's with this I mean, it's this interesting place? that it's first person. Yeah. Cherry blossoms bloom within the grasp of death. What are you hiding inside? 
Leute. Maya. No. Why is this the plot of our community horror story, though? Yeah, they really ripped us off. Ah! Oh, I don't like the way that thing moves. Oh my god, that looks so scary. Oh. Short message. Full game free to play. Is it going to be like available now or something? That'd be cool. Oh, okay. Hey. Konnichiwa. Silent Hill series of producer of Tsumeru Okamoto Motoi desu. Go down to Daita no wa Silent Hill The Short Message to you, Mataka Tarashi Silent Hill to Narimas.本作は本日この後プレイしていただきます。はい、ありがとうございます。ありがとうございます。ありがとうございます。ありがとうございます。ありがとうございます。ありがとうございます。ありがとうございます。ありがとうございます。ありがとうございます。ありがとうございます。
Now. Oh! Focus your mind. <laughs> Collaboration. Is this Metro? Into Metro oh, VR? VR? Oh! oh. Alright. Honestly, a VR Metro game is an extremely good idea. I wonder if it's... Help us out, Metro Super fans. Does this look new or is this like a remake? People are saying it's looking totally new. Oh my <laughs> god, the way I would scream if that happened to be in VR. I mean, that looks a lot like Half-Life Alex, but yeah. in a very, I say that, mm. you know, in a very good way. Yeah. All right, there you go. There's something. Ben, I guess I'll be keeping your PSVR no, too. No, while longer. <laughs> they didn't say exclusive anywhere, did they? I didn't see that, no. But this one is... How'd they get a Vowed gameplay in here? I kid, I kid, Xbox fan. Boy, this is... This is, is not a good comparison to have to go <laughs> they, after. They put them in the wrong order. Yeah, yeah, they absolutely did this dirty by going directly after that. Is this like Morrowind? Choke him out. <laughs> I take uh, it back. That does look great. You bastard nine times. <laughs> it looks like 480. Like the resolution is just bizarrely low. Yeah. It's giving Moro in. Jacob's right. Something about the art style and the resolution. Okay. That was kind of I mean, cool. like, everything that you're doing in here looks very fun to do in VR. It's, okay. We're just making fun of the graphics. But, like, I think this looks... Oh, I think that was... It looks like it was... Oh, and you're... <laughs> okay. Okay, oh. shield. And you're using skulls as shields? Okay, all right, big Marvel fans. What the hell are you? Legendary Tales. Wow. All soon. Right. Very oh, soon. That's my birthday. There you go. <laughs> it's already out on PC, Chad is saying, and it's I awesome. Okay. Oh. Oh, is Dogma right too? Dogma? I make no mistake. The dragon will appear before you. That looks good, y'all. Hate to say it. I hate to say it. Yeah, you hate when games are good. <laughs> Gosh, I was thinking, it's like, I guess maybe this year I'm only going to play six games that are 70 hours long instead of my usual. <laughs> Thank you. What's your name? Just flirting with fight. <laughs> Whoa. Make manifest your will. This music is thick. I've never played Dragon Sogma 1. But I am curious if it's going to be like a direct story continuation. Because yeah, sure. do you know like the ending of that game? No, but maybe you shouldn't say it just in case people are playing. No, it's just very interesting if okay. people want to look it up. Alright. You oh, got cool. me. Yes, you Things will avail you not to watching one. Okay, weird ending, but sure. <laughs> All right, so we're finishing Final yeah, Fantasy VII and, and just rolling right into that. <laughs> For the deepest dive, I think so. Yeah, yeah we gotta do it. I wonder if there's gonna be like as deep of a dive as Stellar Blade got then. Since those are kind of the headliners. Thank you. 19th century Japan.
Huh. I was just in Yokohama in Like a Dragon. I thought that 19th century looked familiar. さあ、敵の攻撃を結構、相性を崩すこともはい。So this definitely looks scaled down in terms of like combat complexity. Yeah. I mean, just more like an open world game, but not, sure. you know, not a full game. Sure. Back as you just saw Stellar Blade. <laughs> I'm thinking about Neo. <laughs>発明家であるイガヒチとインネンを深めると様々な確率を上入手できます。Is <laughs> あ、ライフフォースフィジックスつつむいだいんだ。物語に大きく影響します。イツレグズブロークン。大丈夫だろうにって一人の浪人として運命を切り開いてください。おお、ジシドウィクリーンザブラッドオフスプレイダーバスセ
All right, sure. Just a rematch. All right, here we go. Ooh, Everyone shut up. <laughs> Is that George Milk? I think it's. I think so. God damn it. <laughs> By God damn it, you mean awesome? Yeah. Yep. You got me. She. What are those little hands? It's a, it's a mask she's wearing. It's so funny. Oh my gosh. How did we go through a pandemic and nobody had a mask that cool? Probably because it's not effective in any way, shape, or form. <laughs> it's stupid, no. yeah. <laughs> oh, tentacled. They got wooden They got tentacled. Like I the baby. I can't believe that's George Miller. That's awesome. <sighs> Don't do this. <gasps> oh. 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 Stop it. This is for what? sickos on the internet. Stop it. Wait, are the hands alive? Hello? There's Pee Pee. <laughs> uh, oh it? my gosh, it's like uh, <laughs> magic school bus. <laughs> Magic school bus? Welcome to Drawbridge. So then. true. They're blue. Into the THV Magellan, our mobile base of operations. Come on, I'll help you get your bearings. This is the ship's armory. Here you can so check your when they're in the little ship. They're their gray. Bases. <laughs> These rooms over here belong to other members of the crew. They're pretty much the same as yours. And the shower's down at the end. This is one hell of a ship the monster you energy. Courtesy of the UCA, I'm guessing. They lost that licensing, now, Jeff. As I told now you, it's the drawbridge is a civilian outfit. Random can of their own thing. But we do have a generous patron with access to plenty of capital and tech. Sounds like a UCA big shot. Don't ask me. We've never met face to face. Ooh, the gloves have their own little they silly... This is, oh, man. To Seriously? It. <laughs> That's no better, very... Believe that bullshit. There's, a, there's a boss in... Metal Gear Rising that has those little hands all over her and they do stuff like that. It's the same deal really? as America. The people here are all spread out. Okay, no, oh, I can't wait to play this. One another. Where are we? We want you to help us bring the world together. <laughs> what? Oh, oh stop no. motion, guy! Well, you no, no. You? that's too far. What? Too Alan Wake? <laughs> His knowledge and experience will probably come in handy down the road. Put him in a womb! Yes. yes. Really, Sam? Your buttocks? I love what it. What about shotgun? I prefer That's literally Mimir or whatever from God of War. Yep. Sam, do you read me? You'll first need to access the Mexico side plate gate terminal. Mexico, eh? After we've confirmed network coverage, we can take the DHV Magellan and regroup at your position. The problem is Perfect. everybody wants to be part of the UCA. That's not the plan, Sam. The UCA isn't looking to expand its borders. Oh, wow. Just like with Mexico, they oh, want to bring really new good. regions into the network. Uh. Anyway, the DHV Magellan's here to back you up. As always, you'll be the one leading the way to expand the network. <laughs> What's your role in all this? You're the commander. Oh, I can't wait. I can't wait. This for looks this. That's unbelievably right. good. <laughs> These days, I'm fragile in name only. You brought America Ooh, flash together. Floods. Cool. How to be reborn as the UCA. But I'm afraid the death stranding is far from over. Ooh. Humanity is still Environmental in events is a very cool thing to add to yeah. the death stranding world. Don't act like you don't see Jesus. it. Jesus. A lot of things changed after you went off on your own. Especially within the UCA. Bridge is no longer oversees the distribution network. They withdrew once things were up and running. So your friends and co-workers all went their separate ways. Within network coverage, there's no need to rely on human porters anymore. So after I closed up shop, car. I went and started a new really explaining a lot. One that handles work in regions outside the UCA. We decided to call ourselves Drawbridge. With the support of 
the chiral network and APAS, humanity will be free from the need to move around. Bots are capable of handling deliveries. He's alive. He called himself a ghost, but... He found a way back from the beach just so he could kill us. He said he came back to get revenge on you and me. <laughs> no, it's, uh... What's her name in Joker makeup? Hey, Miss me. Oh, no, wait. No, this is Mr. Drew yeah, Baker, I figured you'd pay this place a visit. Seeing as how I've been distributing the fruits of this fine factory all over the continent. Ham it up. You ham guns it guns up. This is the, the stupidest character in the first game. I'm glad same she's as doing was. exactly the same thing. Oh. <laughs> Looks like you decided to trade in that rope for a stick this go round. Well, I suppose even a porter has to pull the trigger from time to time. <laughs> oh, what about you? Hey, buddy. Are you just another soulless little husk, huh? Let go of me! <laughs> what in the world? <laughs> I love it. I love it. I love the it. the rest of your band? <laughs> no, uh, 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 uh. Is it going to be a tentacle baby or baby? Well, ain't that something? The two genders. Was it you, Heads? <laughs> huh? Was it you that killed Lou? <gasps> you still don't oh, know. No. Me. So Lou, Lou is BB <laughs> from the first game. Oh no! Is that Lou? This is. I cannot believe <laughs> bananas. <laughs> sure. <laughs> Having a baby laugh as a mech. Thing about Lou. All right, Sam. Let's see what we can find on Lou. If you want answers, you're gonna have to find them yourself. But the ones you do find, well, that pain you nurse will only get worse. Sam the man in the dark about everything. He looks like a real baby. Don't forget, coming on this expedition was meant to help you find the strength to carry on. On the beach. We have. We all know you've got this. Oh my gosh, my favorite. Now it's boy. time to finish the journey, Sam. Please oh, understand. I like Sam. the hands though. <laughs> yep. A okay. We never meant to string you along. That chrysalis we found this her is still inside. going. It was filled with a fluid that contained amino acids. One's identical in structure to the kind found in tar. Is he doing is a voice too? I'm uh, sorry. Is that like there are family? amino acids in tar, as in proteins. Of course. How else did you think that chiral creatures could emerge from it? Some have even theorized that the tar is a sort of primordial soup. Okay. I was there. I saw her home. And it was a hellhole. <laughs> you see, after you left Bridges, I decided to do a little digging. Now, according to them, BB-28 was flagged for disposal and subsequently <laughs> incinerated four years ago, long before this you and Lou first met. This is an unbelievable thing to watch for this long. <laughs> it is bananas. I'm, I'm so invested, though. Wow. Oh, 2025. Right. Wow. Let's go. To 2025, please. Special appearance by George Miller. Elle Fanning is the, Elle Fanning. the, the blonde woman who is there. Oh, I was going to say, in my head, it looked like Dakota Fanning, but I was like, but she, that's a bit too young. And now so that makes with perfect me today sense. is visionary game creator and founder of Kojima Productions, Kojima Son. He's here. Hi, welcome. Welcome. Today, I'm excited to announce drip. that together. As part Turn of up the, the heat in the studio. In Kojima Productions partnership, Hideo is going to take us <laughs> on an exciting new adventure. One that I've been encouraging him to reinvent for years. 
はい、えー、全く新しいオリジナルの IP になります、えー、新世代のアクションエスピオナージュー,ー,ージュ準備を始めてますけども、えー、デストランディングのアクションエスピオナージュープロダクションで制作にかかります<笑>ソニーさんとは、えー、ほぼ30年にわたりエスピオナージュものを一緒に育ててきたという強い経験もあります、えー、またソニーさんは、えー、ゲームだけではなく音楽も映画もされています、えー、間違いなく強力なコラボレーションになるはずですえー、さらに2年後には僕の、えー、ゲーム制作人生の40周年を迎えます、えー、このタイトルが、えー、僕の集大成の作品になると確信をしています、yeah. A new action espionage、yeah. game by Hideo Kojima This is one of my favorite genres one that I've been hoping you would revisit with a bold new vision Can you share anything else、oh、about、gosh. this new development? <笑>えー、まだ詳しくは言えませんけども、hey, えー、最先端のテクノロジーと、えー、世界中の才能を集結して作る予定です、えー、もちろんインタラクティブなゲームなんですけども、okay. えー、物語のテーマ、uh, no, キャスト、no. 演技ファッションサウンド<笑>、えー、どれをとっても、えー、同時に映画でもあるようなものです、えー、本作で、えー、映画とゲームの壁を越えたいと思っていますっていうのは、ね、今回の動画はい。I don't know if they can leave multiple reviews. So the point is, your odds are probably higher than you think if you go there and submit a review for the MinMax show on Apple Podcasts. We appreciate that level of direct support for listening to the podcast version of the MinMax show podcast. Okay, there's a lot to unpack. We're going to unpack it all on the MinMax show. Jeff, Lim,、uh, anything you want to get off your chest from what you saw here today since you won't be on? Yeah, I'm, I'm just happy and excited that.、Um... Like, when most people think of Sony exclusives in the past five years or whatever, it's always kind of like open world, third person RPG kind of narrative kind of thing. And like, everything here was really crazy looking and completely、yeah. different from like that mold. So I'm excited. I'm excited about pretty much everything that we saw.、Um, so, yeah. Looking good. That's, that's a great point for sure. Haley, anything pop for you other than Death Stranding, I suppose? <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm going to call it now. 2025, the little marionette's going to be Mad Max's best character. Guaranteed. You're right. <laughs> He's already won. Just lock、um, it in. I mean, I wasn't as interested in the other games just because they weren't genres I normally like, but ending on that really meaty trailer for Death Stranding、yeah. was, got it for me. I'm so excited for that. <sighs> All right.、But、there's a free Silent Hill game. Jesus Christ. Yeah. yeah, that's, that's yeah. such a wild thing. Okay, l o t to unpack on the MinMax show. Thanks again to everybody for watching and supporting the independent channel here at MinMax. We appreciate it, and we'll see you all soon. Goodbye, folks.